Hi, Deborah Vogler here reporting from CONFAB 2011 in Las Vegas. My guest is Thomas Jefferson, who is with ISMI. Thank you so much for doing the interview. Thanks for having me. All right, now the que first question for you. Uh, the industry has long debated whether going to 450 millimeter wa uh, wafers would be beneficial economically. Uh, and of course, I see manufacturers see the, uh, the whole issue differently from the suppliers. Is it time to say the debate is over? I mean, are all, almost all supply, uh, suppliers on board? They are, and I do think it's, it's time to say the debate is over. You know, the initial work was done as far back as 2007. They made it very clear that you know, to get to the historical 30% productivity benefit of a wafer size transition, that was really the way to do it. Um, we've seen a dramatic increase in the readiness and the momentum in the supply chain since the beginning of 2011. No one's asking if anymore at this point. It's, it's all about the t exact timing and, and how we execute. Now, in your uh, speech, uh, you will be doing a presentation at the CONFAB. Mm -hmm. What is the current status of the 450 millimeter program, and where do you expect it to be, oh, a year from now, okay. let's say? Yeah, I, we're doing really well um, at ISMI. We'll, we'll talk a lot in our, in our CONFAB speech about some of the details, but we've dramatically increased the supply of silicon um, in the industry. We're building the factory infrastructure that we need to support operations um, in the Semitech clean room in New York. And we have several new tools uh, that are coming on board. So we're really moving, uh, firing on all cylinders right now um, okay. inside the program. <laughs> now, what challenges remain to be overcome? Right. I think that, you know, fundamentally, we need the entire supply chain ready at roughly the same time. You know, if, if half is early and half is late, that's bad for everyone. Right, right. It's especially bad for those that are early. Um, that's starting to happen. Uh, I don't think that we've seen any technical showstoppers remaining. Uh, at this point, it's simply about getting everyone ready at the same time. And just to add, you know, uh, would be remiss, you'd ask where will we be a year from now. Um, I, I think we're going to be in very good shape. Okay. Uh, I expect our staff to grow significantly uh, within the consortia. I expect to see a significantly larger number of tools, number of wafers, and, and as all this happens, both the materials and the equipment are expected to mature. Okay. All right. Well, thank you very much for thank being you. my guest. Thanks. All right.